PVC. Go and get your PVC. Go and get your bonus card. One Nigeria. One Nigeria is important. Go and get your PVC. Go and get your voter's card. Let us vote someone that we want him to change that contraption. Now you begin to see how your voter's card is working. Now you begin to see how Fulani rolls. Now are you begin to understand and believe that Nigeria owes by Fulani people. They know how to maneuver their way. They know how to rig election. They know how to manipulate everybody. Because Nigeria belongs to them. These people will go all the way of Senegambia, Chad, Niger, Sudan to get people to vote for them. You see now how they are paying people to collect their voter's card. They give you money, you give them their voter's card. They give you money, you give them your voter's card. This is what you will keep on seeing. There is no how Nigeria will be, will be good again. Because corruption is the, is the, is the, you know, anything you are talking about in Nigeria, the corruption is number one. Corruption is the number one activities of Nigeria every single day. Corruption have destroyed a lot of things in that con con contraption. Corruption is the number one of your problem in that contraption. And those people are those in the power. Now you see your voters card. We want to vote them. We want to bring this one. We want to bring who will change Nigeria. Now you see how they want to change Nigeria. You see now with your eyes how they want to change Nigeria. Fulanis want to change Nigeria. Let me tell you people something. I will keep on lamenting. Of course you people will call me talkative. And some of you may call me jobless person. But I'm trying to bring you people out of the mess that you people are into trying to tell you people what is going on trying to let you know that Fulani are coming with conquest there is no how you can ever rule that contraption without the help of Fulani they control everything 1999 constitution was amalgamated by only single person only single person from Fulani Alamajiri, Abul Salami Abu Bakr. 99 constitution that is holding Nigeria today was created by a single man from Fulani. Nobody seated there with him. He just wake up and write the constitution, tell you that Fulani are more in numbers, Fulani have more lands, Fulani are everywhere, Fulani are the powerhouse, Fulani are this, Fulani are that. And today is happening. In your koro koro eyes, and there is nothing you can do about it. All of you from south, you will go to school, you will go to Oxford University, Cambridge, any university you think you come back full and need that is hearing cattle will begin to rule you, and there is no how you can change it. I'm telling you, you can't. These people own Nigeria with the help of British people. They are backing them up, and there is no how you you can't do anything. Now you are seeing it how they are sharing money. Collecting the voters' card from their people, from Chad, from Niger, from Senegambia, they sat all of them down, begin to pay them money and collect their card. Now tell me, how do you think that you can win these people? Can you just tell me, how do you think you can be able to overrun Fulani? How? Fulani are the head of they are the head of judiciary they are the head of state they are the head of uh, uh, what they call it a military they are the head of navy they are the head of every security apparatus in that contraption they are the head they are from head to bottom so tell me how do you want to win these people in election how do you think that you can be able to win Fulani? If Fulani did not support you. Let me tell you people something. I want you people to understand this. The day you African people, black people, wake up from your slumber and begin to embark on this journey that we are, 
to even though bring yourself from mental slavery because what we are seeing now is a physical slavery did we have already gone beyond mental slavery now is physical one that you can see it this is not during the time of slave trade the one that is about to come in nigeria is going to be times 20. Fulani is going to use you to play ping pong very very soon if you people don't wake up and do the needful about you see what i'm showing you people now you see how all of them we are sitting down quietly they are paying them collecting their voters card this is how you want to win fulani in 2023 is it what you're telling me with all these things they are doing this is how you are telling me that you want to bring one person from somewhere who will come and build nigeria for you where the fulani are in charge fulani are in charge Fulani have put in every indigenous people that find themselves in that Nigeria. They have put in them in their armpit. This Fulani we are talking about, I want you all to understand that Fulani are not up to 5%. And Fulani are not the indigenous of that contraption called Damini Buzu, but they are ruling every of you from head to bottom. Fulani are in control of everything in that Nigeria. Fulani are in control of police. Go and see every IG in every state in that contraption. They are run by Fulani people. Go and see every government house in that contraption. They are running by Fulani people. Go and see the petroleum. Go and see everything in our land about petroleum, how the crude oil is going and coming back and transferring and uh, transferring, putting there. All are run by Fulani people. Now tell me, how do you think? How do you think in your coconut head, your head that you don't even have thinking faculty? How do you think that you are going to win Fulani Alamajri in 2023 election that is coming very soon, maybe in five months or six months? How do you think you can win these people? How do you think you can overrun these people? They have already begun to pay people. That is why you don't see Fulani coming on the streets, yapping like you people, talking nonsense like you people. That is why Fulani always plan ahead. They, they always meditate and always plan for long term. That is why they always get all of you people. Some people that we have in our land, they, they, they are supporting Fulani. Fulani now are sharing money. I bring it to you people to see. They are sharing money, collecting. As they are paying money, there are two people. You see them. Oga in the front. The second manager at the back. Oga will pay you. The manager will collect your voter's card. Oga will pay you. The manager will collect it. Come and collect your money. I give you the... Pay me, collect my voter's card. Pay me, collect my PVC. You people are a bunch of idiots talking about 2023 election. Why Fulani have already planned everything, how the thing will work? You people are there searching for somebody to come and build a country that they have already expired. That 1914 amalgamation have already expired and Nigeria was built on fraud. That is why we are not one people. That is why you see oil and water can never mix together they are bringing you islamists they are bringing you wahhabism for you to live together you call yourself a christian and you want to live with wahhabism and the terrorism and you think that you are going to work i am bringing you authentic information now you begin to see it and i know you will believe it good day and welcome